Today I'm going to be talking about um, mainly widely new, used of a theorem called Pick's theorem. Pick's theorem is mainly used to find the area of shapes on lattice points on either a lat on either a rectangular lattice graph or a triangular lattice graph. For a side note, Pick's theorem was invented by Georg Alexander Pick. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first problem is, what is the area in centimeters squared for the figure below? So a first instinct might be to break up the shape into many different uh, rectangles and triangles, but that work is quite tedious. And if you're in a competition, or in or doing competition math, the answers that are most accurate and correct quickly are the ones that are most counted. Use splitting it up into shapes will only waste time. But but we have Pick's theorem. The formula reads that the area denoted by a equals to the number of boundary points, which are the points on the boundaries, which are the ones that I'm circling, the boundary points uh, plus the points on the interior, which are these and subtract one. So this is the theorem. So let's try to apply it to this polygon. So the number of boundary points is uh, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have seven boundary points. So area equals to seven over two plus interior points minus one. And we can just erase these. And now the interior points, it is quite easy to tell that there is only three interior points. One, two, three. So area equals to seven over two, which is equal to 3.5, up plus three minus one. And the area is in 6.5 minus one, and, and that is equal to 5.5. And the unit is in centimeters squared because this land is one centimeter and so this so we can say the answer equals to 5.5 uh, centimeter uh, so now we can try another problem we're still going to be working in centimeters squared. So uh, that's the units. Okay, let me draw a figure. Okay, uh, so this is our figure, and now let's try to find the area of it. Let me just neaten this up. Okay, so that's our figure. And we know the formula is A equals to B over 2 
plus i minus one and it would be really nasty if we actually had to do the do, actually uh, the actual computation into splitting this up into different pieces but but we have it now and so we can find the number of boundary points one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve okay so there's twelve boundary points so the area so the area is going to be twelve over two 12 over 2 plus the interior points minus 1. So the area is going to equal to 6 plus i minus 1. The interior points, let's see how many there are. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So then a equals to 6 plus 6 minus 1. So then a equals to 12 minus 1. And that is equal to 11. So the area is equal to 11 centimeters squared. And that is our answer. Okay, so let's move on to our to the next problem. What is the area in in centimeters squared for the figure below. Oh, this this is in a tri triangular. Tri is in a triangular lattice form. Well, there's a act there's a formula for this. So if we double the right hand side of 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 the rectangular equation. We get b over two plus i minus one, and and we multiply this by two. So that and that, so that's the equation. So if we solve for it, we get b plus two i minus two so that is a formula for finding the area of 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 a tri of of a polygon with lattice points on a triangular lattice diagram so let's count how many they are there are so there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four. Okay, so we have a uh, twenty four, so the area. Of the boundary, uh, the, the boundary points is twenty four. The interior are, is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then we multiply that by two minus two, so the area is equal to twenty four plus fourteen minus two is equal to thirty eight minus two. That is equal to 36. Oh, and, and this is in a centimeter squared. Okay, so that's all for this video uh, on a PIX uh, theorem. So uh, this is part one of the video. Uh, and part two will be coming out soon on more difficult and more 
elaborate problems on pick stereo thing um stay tuned subscribe like and I'll turn on notifications thank you for watching and enjoy